profit and loss, cost price and selling price. The price that the seller buys the stuff at is called the cost price. The price that the seller sells the things at is called the selling price. Cost price is the buying price. Selling price is the selling price. Find out the cost price and selling price. A fruit seller got apples for rupees 700 and sold them for rupees 1000. The cost price is rupees 700. The selling price is rupees 1000. An electronics dealer sold washing machines for rupees 35,000 which he had purchased for rupees 45,000. The cost price is rupees 45,000. The selling price is rupees 35,000. If selling price is more than cost price, then there is a profit. If selling price is lesser than cost price, then there is a loss. Look at the deal again and say whether it is a profit or a loss. What is more? The cost price is more. If the cost price is more, the seller lost money. So, it is a loss. Look at the deal again and say whether it is a profit or a loss. What is more? The selling price is more. If the selling price is more, the seller made money. So, it is a profit. Can you find out how much the profit or loss is? You have to find the difference between the cost price and the selling price. Profit is selling price minus cost price. Loss is cost price minus selling price. Basically, you subtract the bigger price from the smaller number. You already know if it's a profit or a loss. So just call it that. Look at the deal again and calculate the profit or loss. Here, the loss is equal to cost price minus selling price. So that is 45,000 minus 35,000, which is 10,000. So the loss is 10,000 rupees. Look at the deal again and calculate the profit or loss. Here, the profit is equal to selling price minus cost price. So, that is 1000 minus 700, which is 300. So, the profit is 300 rupees. Suresh brought 6 chairs and a dining table for rupees 15,500. He sold it all for rupees 20,000. How much profit did he make? The cost price is rupees 15,500. The selling price is rupees 20,000. Since the selling price is more than cost price, we have a profit. The difference between 20,000 minus 15,500 is 4,500. The profit is rupees 4,500. The owner of Metro stores purchased a dozen pencils at rupees 2 per pencil. He sold all the pencils for rupees 30. Was there a profit or loss? And how much? Let us find the cost price first. The owner bought 12 pencils at rupees 2 each. That means his cost is rupees 2 into 12, which is 24 rupees. He sold them all at rupees 30. That is the selling price. 
selling price is greater. So, it is a profit. Because selling price is greater, we have a profit. The profit is rupees 30 minus rupees 24, which is rupees 6. How well have you understood profit and loss? That well, huh? Excellent!